What is going on, everybody? My name's Jacob Forster, and welcome to Indigo Park. I have had a lot of people recommend that I check this game out. Brand new little... I think it's a mascot horror game, so... This is chapter one. So, similar to... The game that shall not be named. Uh, the first one is free, but I'm sure that the other things will... Yeah, 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 it's fine. Actually, I, don't, I have no idea. Who knows if more chapters are going to be paid, DLC or not. That was Poppy Playtime, actually, not Ban Ban. <laughs> Isaac Indigo's Indigo Park. Oh, okay. For all who journey to this newfound paradise... Oh, that's weird. Indigo Park offers that was weird. He's like a rendered a face. To call your own. No in subtitles? Place, echoes of days gone are brought back to life as a new generation captures a glimpse of the exciting potential of tomorrow. Indigo hmm. Park pays homage to the values, dreams, and unwavering... Pays homage! ...rise to our great nation. Here you embark on the journey of a lifetime. What am I looking at? Someone's... ...creativity, joy, and fantasy. ...streamer setup? <laughs> oh, no! What is this intro setup? What is this streamer setup, by the way? What is going on? I don't have that third uh, upright monitor for chat. Mom's favorite. Harmony. Doing another search. Want to come with me? What is it? Last time I've gone with you, you have sucked. Lamau. Oh, is it kind of like an uh, urbex? Little urban exploration kind of deal? Come meet Finley. Can't miss experiences. <laughs> Bird up! <laughs> Local park's sudden closure. Oh boy, this is uh, really, they're really going all out on the music. Oh my gosh, Rambly. <laughs> they got their merch going. <laughs> okay, okay, chapter one, birds of a feather. I, okay, I actually like the way that this is opening up. I'm having a, uh, I've heard good things about this. So I've got, a, I've got some good expectations going into this one. Oh my gosh. Find a way into the park. Already this, oh, look at my, <laughs> look at my hand. <laughs> it's like, I got a hammer, I gotta break this thing open. <laughs> cool. Oh, flashlight works, love that, love to see that. Danger, police tape, do not enter. The police were here. Nice moon, very beautiful. Very powerful. <laughs> uh, there, there was a trend on TikTok. No, I, I, you know, it's not, it's not really a trend. It's just really niche <laughs> memes that would pop up for me, and uh, they, they've had a random resurgence. Like they happened maybe a year ago, where it's just like some AI voice that was doing like some reviews of animals. And they're like very beautiful, very powerful. Very beautiful, very powerful. I think it was beautiful, powerful. But it was something, very something, very powerful. And I don't know why I got a kick out of it. And I just saw something on my For You page pop up with that. Hello. Found a collectible. Visit an information kiosk to learn more. So what's going on with this? Little power uh, center? I don't know if I'm supposed to do anything with it. Indigo Park. I guess we must find our way in. Oh my gosh, is this another collectible? Oh, found a collectible at the information desk. I don't know if I want to go looking for collectibles. Oh, you can jump in this game. That's nice. It's always a plus. Okay, let's uh, let's play the game. <laughs> Not just run around looking at random stuff. Ooh, what's this? Let's look at random stuff again. That is a detailed bag. What is that? What is that even supposed to be? I don't even know. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I'm distracted. I'm a wrangler. For sure I'm a wrangler. Let's go inside. Oh, yeah. wonder how spooky this game is going to become. Hi there, and welcome to Indigo Park. The world's most innovative and engaging family fun experience. Family fun? Welcome to the world of your favorite character. Can't wait. You're our first guest in 2,920 days. Oh my. Three minutes and 38 seconds. <laughs> Why are you keeping track? I'm Rambly. Rambly the raccoon. 
You gonna be yapping? To make sure your the whole time? The Indigo Park is the most fun it can be. Just hop sure. on over to the registration center to your left, where our friendly assistant will help you begin your adventure in the park. Oh. To your left! Press E to interact while looking at an object. Let's freaking go. <laughs> the arm going flying is great. Um, oh, he didn't interact. Hi, I'm Ram. Hi, Ram. And it's my job to make sure your experience here at Indigo Park is registered. Let me just get a good look at you. Oh, he's looking at me with the webcam. You don't seem to have your face in our guest list. Mm. Is this your first time here at the park, or did I don't you know. just get plastic surgery? No worries. It's Ramley Tuesday, so you qualify for a big discount on your visit. It's to Thursday. The main gate. Thank you very much. Ooh, I can't As wait of recording for you to this. see everything Indigo Park has to offer. Uh, oh, I, I can't. I can't keep sitting down on the on the chair. Meet Rambly at the park's main gate. Also, I forgot to uh, forgot to turn on one of my little overhead lights, so I'm gonna do that. Oh crap. I'm gonna do that right now. Sorry, everybody. Well, I guess I'll move forward then. Um, so I need to go in here, or what are these noises? What are these noises that I'm hearing? That's very strange. Also, I'm, I'm distracting you so I can turn on my overhead light. <laughs> I'm not editing this out. There we go. Got a little bit of light above me. Perfect. Okay, so is the front door gonna be open then? Kiosk. Enjoy my stay. What's the hold up? Oh! It's open. Head on into the entryway. It's not open. Hmm, hold on. My mistake. The gate is not open. There seems to be an error message being sent from the gate's power unit. You got those weird Lucky like. You. you get to be the first person to try our turn on the generator mini rambling venture. Have fun. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Rambly. You you've got those weird glitchy eyes. You're evil, for sure. I mean, it's pretty obvious, but, uh... Okay, so adventure. I need to turn on the gang? The, 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 the door? Oh, here's a little kiosk. That's fun looking. Alright, so, follow the power line. Got it. Goes into here. Stop watching me! I see you looking at me. Oh, here we go! We go in a little room! Ah, the Indigo Violet Compact Power Generator. But it seems to be inoperable. Looks like it's missing a piece. Can you find it? Oh, sure thing, Rambly. Sure thing. Oh my gosh, look at that big old lever. Okay, so I need to find a stinky little cog for this machine. Where, oh where, could stinky little cog be? I guess we must go exploring. Shouldn't we? <laughs> Rambly, are you gonna give me any hints? Is it supposed to be in this room? Is it uh, hiding somewhere weird? Is Molly McCaw's rooftop something? Where? Oh, where? Oh my gosh, there it is! The cog! The gear. Here's the gear for you. Time to flip it to switch. Oh, yeah. Oh my gosh, I have lights, finally. I hear music. Oh, the lights are on! So nice! Alright, Rambly. Okay, for real this time. Thank you! Welcome to Indigo Park! Thank you! I'm so glad to be here. Can't wait to go exploring this park! Surely nothing bad is gonna happen to me. <laughs> Press F to toggle your flashlight. Already learned it, game! Don't need to tell me twice. Hmm. Must have plushies, please. Okay. I like the setup for this. It's very overgrown. Actually looks decayed and grody. Found another collectible. Perfect. Wranglers only! That's me! I guess not this time. Not this time. Okay. I'll keep looking through. Really rambly. Every guest needs a critter cuff. That will oh. allow you access to reserve areas, charge payments to your room, and wear a critter cuff! I think there's some in the gift shop. Head gift in there and I'll shop. get you set up. Oh, okay. Welcome, please have your critter cuff ready to scan. If you don't have a critter cuff, please visit the information desk or the critter co-op to get yourself registered. Okay. Sounds good. Oh, 
that looks like the place to be. Um, I'm assuming none of these are the actual collectibles, right? Even though they look identical Here to you go, buddy. Your Oh my own critter cuff. A new way to interact with the park that also doubles as a pedometer, heart monitor, and moon ring. <laughs> How are you moving that? <laughs> cool. I have a critter cuff now. Thank you, Rambly. Appreciate you. There's like a weird whistling uh -oh. melody. The door mysteriously locked. Why not test out your band and save the day? Okay, thanks. <laughs> Are these real t-shirts? <laughs> All right, let's try my band. It's just like a theme park for real. Oh, it's so bright. Great work, buddy. Now try entering the park, and we can start our indigo adventure. Thanks. Thanks. Appreciate it. Let's start this indigo adventure together. Just you and me, and the horrors of this place. Hello. How are you doing, Rambly? Rambly and... <laughs> Ew. 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 I don't like him looking at me. Ew. <laughs> it's gross. Ew, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Okay, let's... Oh, explosive barrels. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go see what I could do in this park. Let's see how much I can break this. <laughs> I'm in the jungle now. All right, all right, for reals, for reals. Let's get moving. Let's get over here. <gasps> Bird up! Bram, bram, bram. Fantastic, Eric Andre skit. Um, they're always watching me. They always seem to be watching me. Oh, that's it, that's the end of the game. Wow, what a great demo. <laughs> I kid, I kid. Oh my gosh! <laughs> well, that's great. It, this is really funny because this is, like, this little entranceway is exactly what it's like at Disneyland. Because um, there's always these, like, posters of all the different rides. Literally, on as you come in, you go to the right, and you go into this little bridge which has the train for Disneyland. There's no bathrooms, but uh, there's, like, the little thingies. Or at least that's how it used to be. I haven't been to Disneyland in a while. Let's go to the bathroom! Pee pee time. I was really hoping to have you be a robot that looks at me. I miss, I miss FNAF. I miss security breach. Pee pee time. No, I can't even pee pee time. No. Zero out of 10 game. <laughs> How about the women's restroom? Can I pee pee time in here? Please. Oh, what is that? Oh my gosh. It's a Funko Pop. <laughs> Collectible found. Let's go. All right. That's enough out of that. No PP, zero out of ten. <laughs> Pardon our dust, but oh hi. Looks like the park is going through some renovations. For the inconvenience, your Rambly Tuesday discount will be free. Percent off. Why not free? celebrate this great deal with a ride on my railroad? To test your sleuthing skills, I'll let you find this one all by yourself. Uh, okay, sure. I. You know, I'm not too sure what you actually want me to find, but I'm just gonna go. Rambly's Railroad, oh boy! I don't wanna go on this ride. I wanna ride this ride, am I tall enough to ride this ride? I'm just a child. I'm just, I'm just a child with a flashlight and a little wristband. How, how do I know how tall I- I saw that. <laughs> I Spatial data suggests you may be a bit older than the target audience for this ride. Oh, I'm not a child. It's one of my favorites. Do you know why Rambly the raccoon loves Rambly's Railroad? Because I like trains. Because <laughs> I like trains. <laughs> Sensational. Sensational. Well, who was that little critter that was peeking behind? Peeking just behind the corner there. Has me a little bit worried. Also, with all the debris and all the overgrowth that's happening here, how am I expecting this ride to operate? How do I know there's not things along the track that are gonna deal re derail this whole thing? <gasps> Guess we're gonna find out. Guess we're gonna find out. Hi, Rambly. He's just peeking. Oh, yeah, Rambly's Railroad. Rambly's Railroad. I'm Conductor Rambly. <laughs> oh, Rambly, what happened? 
Oh, okay. Oh, hi. What's up? Oh, look at this. Oh, oh look, it's Molly McCaw. It's Molly McCaw, the greatest pilot you ever saw. Oh, Molly McCaw. Why, you only crashed into six bars this week. Six? I'm s I'm I'm suspicious. Very suspicious. Oh, thank you. Oh, spooky. Okay, there's more debris. <gasps> Coconut Island! Seagull! Oh, there was a dead seagull. Okay. Oh, we're underground? Underwater! Come on out and greet the people! I win. Finley. Quite a long face and body. You've known me for 100 years, Randy. 100 years? I'm always long because I'm always longing <laughs> for a new seashell from my collection. Oh, Finley, you should come out of your shell. How about you come into it instead? My ride, oh. Oceanic Odyssey. Are you just you all about the wonders down under the deep blue sea? Are they all just advertising their own rides? As me. Uh, I hope you'll visit. I'm not gonna visit. I'm sorry. No, you keep staying lonely. Oh. oh, oh, what was that? What was that? Oh, this part of the ride is all busted up. back up and running. Oh, it's broken. Rambly. What's happening to you, buddy? It's an evil AI. That's what it is. Oh. I didn't expect that to open, but sure. Oh, these open just like security breach. You don't actually have to do anything. They just open for you. That's cool. I don't like you. I don't like you that much. Ah, oh. what was your name, Lloyd? L Lloyd Lemos? Okay. What do I do? Oh, I need to find more gears. Of course I do. Oh my gosh, collectibles. <laughs> um. Oh, there's a gear. A one. Let's see. Oh, and there's number two. So easy. Easiest game I've ever played. Game for babies. Hop back on the train. Don't mind if I do. It's a game for babies. No scary things. See, see, not a problem. Not a problem at all. <laughs> back on this wonderful little ride. Oh, we're going up. We're really going up, huh? Where are you taking me, Rambly? Oh! Hey, Lloyd. Do not shame me with that common folk name! <laughs> I am the proud, the prestigious, the professional Lloydford L. Lion, actor extraordinaire! Great act, Lloyd. <laughs> of course it was! I'm he hates Lloyd! Why do you hate Lloyd? What's wrong with Lloyd? It's a little pretentious, I gotta say, but, uh, you know, uh, he's just a, he's just a little lion. That's it, that was the whole ride. Lovely. Oh, my wristband! So, what do you think? Pretty fun, right? Now you know all about my friends. And Lloyd. So what do you think <laughs> and Lloyd. Where do I want to go? Oh my gosh, is that me? Oh my gosh, that's me! That's me right there! Can you see me? <laughs> what is that? Oh, <gasps> that's what I saw. I saw the friend, the, the the bird. The bird. Creepy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they have Rambly shirts. <laughs> I'll take one. Oh, Rambly hat too. This is this is just Disneyland. This is this is the most inspiration of Disneyland I've ever seen. This is great. 
Oh, look at this. Oh my, this is just Disneyland. This person must have been to Disneyland many times, because or at least heavily influenced this is off of uh, Disneyland's infra like spatial positioning. There's a whole center like this. Got the old school buildings. Lloyd's main theater, main stage theater. Lloyd Live. What else we got around here? Got the cool spinning fountain. Love that. L love that for La Lloyd. I know that's not Lloyd. Leave me alone. Oh, Alice's shakeups. You know, I'll, t oh, I'll take a orange strawberry lemonade shakeup, please. Thank you. Man, I should go back to Disneyland. It's so expensive. <laughs> and they have a new thing where you have to like. So if you get season pass, I used to have a season pass growing up for like one or two years. Um, bought it like when I was in college. Was it high school or college? <gasps> I can't go in. So sad. <clears throat> and uh, it was great because you could just you just go to Disneyland anytime you wanted to. Or um, I mean, depending on what kind of pass you had. If you had the no limits pass, you could literally go any day, whenever you want, free parking. Cafe de Raton Laurel. Coffee, sweets, and treats. Hmm. Let's check it out. And uh, now they have it where... Is that, is that a moldy cookie? Oh my gosh, collectible! <laughs> now they have it where if you want to go, you have to schedule it out in advance if there's not too many people who've already scheduled it out in advance. Even if you have like the top tier pass, you're still beholden... Where's the doorknob right in the middle? Uh, still beholden to like the schedule and available dates if it's not like too crazy or too busy and that just like ruins the whole peel because i used to just love being like you know i'm just gonna go to disneyland today and i had a pass and i was just like okay i'm here <laughs> but i always love going and just walking around and getting fun treats eating there's always good like they're always so expensive but there was always good restaurants there's like a chili bread bowl that was always tasty came in a sourdough boule oh oh my gosh it's so good Obviously, you gotta write all the rides. Uh, let's see, what kind of uh, what kind of sweets and treats and coffees we got? Cones, cups, and buckets of ice cream? It's pretty cheap. Chocolate cookie, four dollars! That's pretty expensive. Decaf a regular, three bucks. Eight dollar frappuccino. You just give me a four dollar latte, thank you very much. Okay, nothing else in here. I'm ranting, I'm rambling, leave me alone. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Off to Main Street. What's going on up there? What's going on up there? Um, hold on, Mister. Oh, fine. I'll go over there first. What do you want from me, huh? What do you want from me? There's an information kiosk. If there's anything around the park you want to ask me about, just stop by here and I'll ramble on about oh. it. Oh, <laughs> you're so funny. The. Oh, oh, I got this. I know the commercial by heart. Wow! It's the unlimited edition <laughs> Rambling the Raccoon Ratchet figure. Push him down and he jumps. Push him up and he does it. Only $19.99 at your favorite toy store. Incredible. Uh, I didn't think it was actually going to do something. The Raction figure. It's all, it's the all new Rambly the Raccoon re, sorry, Raction figure. Available at your local toy store. Souvenir cup. When I was a kid, they used to have free unlimited refills on these things. I once drank so much burnt up that I got sick and threw up while riding rooftop races. That poor kid behind me. Molly plush. I remember when my mom took us to the parks one summer. Her favorite was always Molly. So when they first opened the new Molly meet and greet in Jetstream Junction, we were some of the first in line. Finley plush. The sea serpent always kind of freaked me out. I love aquariums and fish, but the size of him always made me feel uneasy as a kid. Lloyd plush. I feel like a, as a kid, Indigo used Lloyd a lot more. He was always one of my favorites. <gasps> Rambly plush. Ah, uh, there's my buddy. Kind of feels like Rambly has a whole empire now, being the main man of Indigo and all. And the Rambly ears. I remember watching those old DVDs that Indigo would send to your house when you booked a reservation. They always advertised the biggest gift shops and made all the silly merchandise look so fun. My dad promised me he'd buy me a pair when we went. Ooh, that's a Rambly cup. Nothing beats the taste of fresh rambleberry juice drunk directly out of my plastic, lifeless head. Incredible. Oh, Molly Plush. She's always been my best friend. Did you know she builds planes in her landing pad in the park? And then she crashes them. 
She's so talented. Sounds like a great person. You found my buddy Finley. You know, he's really shy. Like, too shy. Like, obnoxiously shy. He's got a good heart. I hope you get to meet him someday. Uh, I'll wait on Lloyd, because he's going to be real weird. You found me! Whoa! Look adorable. Whoa! Rambly ears. Those used to fly off the shelves. Used to. That pair is pretty damaged, though. Keep your eyes peeled. There's got to be at least one more mint condition hmm. set out there somewhere. I mean, I did I just come sale. through a gift shop with all of them. Lloyd. <laughs> Perfect. This is exactly what I was expecting. Bird up! I'll take a... Bird up? A Kohler? A soda? Dr. Muncher? <laughs> Kohler? Sugar-free? Water and diet water? Love it. Absolutely love it. Okay. Um, I really just have a bit too much free roam right now. <gasps> Is that a golden plushie? Is it golden Freddy? Oh my gosh. I uh, just played through the original Five Nights at Freddy's for my birthday, for a birthday stream, and uh, had a blast. I'd only played five, the original Five Nights at Freddy's once before, here on YouTube, and shop of photos. Can't come inside. And I struggled so much with the game when I first played it, because I just didn't understand oh, the mechanics. At You're at Jetstream Junction. Oops. Looks like Jetstream Junction's being tuned up. Stinky. I check there's a security office in the back of the theater. Okay. Any friendly Wrangler can help you get in. Oh! We got orange level. Let's go. Find the key to the Jetstream Junction at Lloyd's main stage. Uh, but yeah, so I played it for my birthday stream. Because I was like, oh, you know what? This would be fun. It's probably going to take up a long time because it's very difficult. I only played through the Five Nights at Freddy's. I never played through the Sixth Night in my original playthrough. Which was only, what, like a year ago? A year and a half ago? Maybe it was two years ago. A little while ago. Gold Ramley plush. Yes. Yeah, so wait, they were so money hungry that they just recolored Ramley and called it a new product? Kind of lazy, don't you think? Wow, is that a limited edition Gold Ramley plush? Parents were fighting tooth and nail for those things when they came out. Seriously, our employees had to clean up so many straight teeth and nails. Hard to believe there was all that demand for a regular Rambly plush we just blasted with gold spray paint. <laughs> Perfect. But yeah, so we played it for the birthday stream, and I just blasted my way through it. This previous was on Game Fa uh, Wow, can't speak. Previously, it was on Game Pass, and uh, they took all of the FNAF games off Game Pass, so I had to rebuy it on Steam, so I had to play from scratch, and I got through all five nights plus the sixth night in, like, like two hours, I think, or even less than that. It was wild. It was a great time. I had a fun time. Five Nights at Freddy's. Spectacular. Oh, thank you. Thank you for letting me in. So what do we got going on in here? Lloyd's Theater? What is that? LED 1705 watt. Nice. Got some little lights. Oh my gosh. This is a fancy theater for... Is Lloyd a real lion? <laughs> I don't know how I feel about this. Uh, Lloyd? Nobody said that you were real. This is like, uh, what? what oh gosh, what, what? What's the? What's the? The Vegas cat lion tamers names? It's Sigmund and Roy. Is that what it is? Siegfried? Siegfried and Roy? Hey, buddy. Oh. I've got eyes all over the park, but I can't see anything behind the stage. Uh -oh. Going back there. Be careful. Your crap uh -oh. is not yet able to resuscitate you. Not yet. What do you mean, not yet? Are you going to revive people from the dead? <gasps> piano! I can play the piano? <laughs> Love it. I'm such a good piano player. Let's go. That's enough out of you, piano. Oh, I can play without even looking. Let's go. I'm even better than I thought. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, oh, wranglers only. I'm definitely a wrangler. Hello? Anybody out here? 
watching me again. I see you, Laloid. <laughs> Mr. Laloid, I just want to say hello. Maybe give you a nice little pet. Probably haven't had love in 3,096 days, 43 minutes, 12 hours, and 63 seconds. <laughs> ah, Mr. Lloyd, where have you gone to? This game has already captured my uh, incessant need for collectibles, unfortunately. <laughs> I'm looking around in every little crevice and corner to try to find the next collectible. Who knows if I'll actually be able to get them all. Probably not. Probably. More than likely not. Doesn't hurt to try, though. Definitely doesn't hurt to try. Oh my gosh, big Lloyd statue! Lloyd. Why do you <laughs> Oh buddy! You okay? <laughs> I was about to ask, why do you and Ramley have beef, buddy? What's going on with that, huh? Oh, I'm sorry that box hurt you. It seemed unfortunate. Hopefully you're okay. Hopefully you're okay. <laughs> Alright, um, and keep looking around. Beep, pop, beep, pop, beep, pop, beep. Cool, cool. I don't see anything. No plushies, no collectibles? What is this? Oh, thank you. Hmm. Very interesting. <gasps> the little changing room? What is this? A nice little tree. Molly McCaw's rooftop raises. What is this? A key to the Jetstream Junction. Oh my gosh. Come meet Finley at the Oceanic Odyssey. I hear you. I hear you running around out there. Am I, am I supposed to avoid you now going all the way back? He got, he got smushed. And now he's back with a vengeance. He wants to hurt me. Lloyd? Lloyd? Promise I'm not here to hurt you. Oh, I can't jump on the boxes. Lloyd? Don't mind me. It's just your favorite neighborhood wrangler. Just coming on through. I got my key. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. I know you want to be left alone. That's okay. That's okay with me. That's okay with me. All right, simple, easy, simple, easy. Just gotta walk back. Just gotta walk back to the to the main square, to the main circle. Lloyd, is that you roaring, Lloyd? Are you going to let me through peacefully? Oh gosh, that one scared me. He's just purring. He's purring like a big cat purrs. It's not a problem. Not a problem at all. I pose no threat to you, Lloyd. No threats at all. I'm just gonna sprint now. I'm leaving, Lloyd. Oh, such a nice Lloyd. Yo, my arm is buff. Lloyd. Oh. Oh. Oh, sorry, Lloyd. Huh. My arm band let out a high pitched squeal that hurt Lloyd. Oh my gosh, it's the Falcon Girl! What are you doing here? Hmm. Very strange indeed. Very suspicious. <laughs> very beautiful. Very powerful. <laughs> well, Yes, it's time to get on out of here. Keep looking around and see if I can find any more secrets. Something's gonna jump out at me right here, right now. Surprise, surprise, nothing. Bloop. Off we go, back to the square. Circle. Main square, main circle, main walkway. The town square. Pretty lights. 
Wow. Look at that Ferris wheel. Can't wait to go on that bad boy. All right, well. I wonder where this is based in. I would guess... Peru. <laughs> yes, that would make sense. <laughs> I would guess... Scandinavia. I would guess... By the architecture. Definitely. The moon. Alright, I got the key for the thingy. Let's go! Alright, this feels like the, uh, the climax area. There's nowhere else to explore on the main junction. The main square. Say, oh, why don't you check out Molly's rooftop races? It's not sure. far from here, and it's a great warm-up before we get into the bigger rides. Just take it up at Molly's landing pad. Thanks, Rambly. You want to get some snacks, please? Indigo Park concession. <gasps> Pretzel dog! Yo, oh, give me a big old pretzel. Give me the pretzel. Have it rolled in the cinnamon sugar and butter. Oh my. I'm salivating right now. <laughs> Rooftop basis. Molly's garage. The landing pad. Wait, which, which one? Uh, which one do you want me to go to? Who dropped this? Who dropped this here? Who left this right here? Let's go to the garage. This is the food section. It is. Oh my gosh. Build your own burger. BYO burger. Barbecue bacon burger. And a gold special loaded hot dog. Not enough. Get it rambly style. Get it bigger. Make it a one footer. Lettuce, tomato slices, onion, pickles, cheese, bacon, avocado, guacamole, fried egg, mushrooms, jalapenos, ketchup, mustard, mayonnaise, barbecue sauce, hot sauce, sliced bell peppers, coleslaw, pineapple, arugula, spinach, sliced olive, salsa, hummus, ramble sauce, fried onions, or onion rings, tomato jam. I'm in. <laughs> I'm in, baby. <laughs> Give me all of it. <laughs> What's up here? I find secrets. Where are the secrets? Barbecue bacon burger. Um, there's nothing up here. Waste of my time. But I do get to see this sick little plane. There is in uh Wait, where where am I going? Oh, here we go. There is like an arrow like a a, a space what am I saying arrow space? There is a plane related ride in Disneyland too that's like Similar to this. I don't know if it still exists. I think I think they may have changed it out, but it was a plane that was in The front of the building was a plane that broke through it and you can go get food in there. That's always a pretty good one Was this bird up? Oh my gosh. Oh my god. They got rambly rush. Oh No, Molly's plane crash somewhere in Rambleberry. Let's play this little mini game Rambly Oh no, Molly's plane crashed somewhere in Rambleberry Woods! Better find her and make sure she's okay. Oh. Oh. Oh yeah. Oh, these are real floaty controls. I'm assuming I can't touch it. Can I jump on you? Oh, I killed him! I killed him, I'm sorry! Oh, I can double jump! Oh, this is fun! Whee! Alright, when is this gonna glitch out and get all creepy, spooky? Are there secrets down here? No. Maybe there are, I don't know. Oh, I need the I need the brambleberry. Thank you. I like the use of the 2D plus 3D. Oh my gosh, they're in love! Pure love! Okay. Oh! Oh my! Let's go. Shoot me straight up into the air. Love that. Is it the Donkey Kong 60, uh, Donkey Kong Country pipe? Wee! 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 They should just make a whole game like this. This is great. Let's go! Little 2D, 3D side scroller action. Uh oh. This is. Uh oh. Molly! What happened? Uh. Hey, Rambly. I was flying through the woods. But suddenly, I couldn't see a thing! Oh my gosh, who's that? 
Looks like my smokescreen made her crash right on target. Salem? I should have known you were behind this, you shady skunk. Let her go. Nah. How's about I try my new potion on her instead? I'm tired of wasting it on squirrels. Molly, look out! <gasps> no, evil. Evil Molly. Okay. Too slow, dumpster face! What what did you do to her? Meet the new and improved Molly Macaw. Now with none of that friendship garbage stopping her from tearing you to pieces. Uh-oh. Wonder what she really thinks of you now. Have fun finding out! Well, thanks, Salem. Appreciate you. <laughs> Boss battles? Let's go? Do I have to kill Molly? <laughs> Is this gonna have serious ramifications for our real-life friendship? Oh my... Boss battles? <laughs> oh my eardrums. <laughs> my eardrums. Oh. Well, that's weird. Very nice. Very good. Very good. That's exactly what I wanted. Collectible. <laughs> Spectacular. Um, well, how about we go to the landing pad? What's over here? Is it locked? It's locked. It's la locked. <laughs> Curses. Laloy, did you do this? Did you la lock the door? I hope not. Well, it la looks like I'm going up to the rooftop races. <laughs> This is a bit spooky. What's over here? Hello? Any crazy little creatures out here? <gasps> oh my gosh! Who is this? Is this a fake Snoopy? <laughs> I need to know more about you! This little dog! Okay, well... It's getting so dark. Sometimes the flashlight works, and sometimes it's just like pitch black. Oh no! Oh, this is horrible. What's oh, horrible, Rambly? Looks like Molly crashed into the right again. Don't worry oh. though, your pal Rambly has the repairman on speed dial. <laughs> Sounds like he's not picking up, Rambly. We're sorry. The number you have dialed has been disconnected or is no longer in service. Please check the number and dial again. Beep boop boop. Say, why don't you check out Molly's landing pad? It's not okay. far from here and it's a great cool down after that exhilarating ride. Sure. Take a down from Molly's rooftop races. Fine, fine. I was just there, Mr. Raccoon. I guess I'm going down, down, down. To the landing pad. Are you gonna open it for me? Oh my gosh. The light's on. I can actually access this. Let's go. It's so tall. Nice. To the landing pad. Hello. What's up, dude? Oh my gosh. Fantastic. Let's play. That's what I'm doing. YouTube Let's Play. The greatest thing you've ever seen, Mr. Why did it get so dark all of a sudden? It's getting darker. Weird. Um, I don't know what I'm supposed to do with these, so I'm not going to interact with them. Is it? Oh. Okay. So there's a thing in... Um, I've, I've messed around with very little amounts of game development stuff before. Very minimal. I wouldn't say I know game dev really much at all. But I know like a, like a couple little things here and there. And I think what is happening with this is with the lighting specifically, there's like a section in some of like the in-game engine where you can turn on or off a setting that has your your player adjust their eyes to the brightness to certain settings. And I mean, it's, it's fine if it's intentional, but for some of these sections where you're kind of going in and out or like when I've had my flashlight really close to a wall in a cutscene and then it comes back, it's like your eyes adjusting to the light, your iris changing the kind of overall style of the lighting. I don't know why I said style. You know what I'm trying to say. Um, 
So I wonder if this game would benefit a little bit more from it being not like that. That way the dev has a bit more control over the actual lighting in the game. Okay, so I'm here in the landing pad. What do you actually want me to do? Is there uh, some indication how I'm supposed to get this going? I do like the ball pit. Ball pit's pretty sick. Okay, purple. So red and blue. But what does the triangle and all these other shapes mean? Triangle, star. Oh. Uh, <laughs> what did I do? <laughs> oh, I thought those were eyes. I thought those were eyes. Oh! Molly, what are you doing? <laughs> Guess we're gonna play together. Time to play. Just me and my friend Molly. Oh, I hate, I hate, oh, I hate going through tubes in video games. Back to slide in the woods. Oh, Molly. Oh, Molly. <laughs> You're dropping some blood there, Molly. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on a second there. I think there was another section I could have walked over to first. We've got a loud car outside. <laughs> Please ignore me. <laughs> this this video is chock full of randomness for me. Gotta say. Oh, okay. So you're supposed to do this first. Oh, no. Oh. I didn't want to come down here. Oh, I guess I died. <gasps> Boing. Well, now I can't get back. Well, shoot. Should I have gone the other way first? <laughs> Molly? Molly. Well, that's a far drop. Okay, got some weird glitching music. Love that. Oh, here we go. Okay, so green triangle. All right, we're figuring out through here. Got it. Green triangle. I wasn't paying attention previously. Green triangle. Whee! Whee! Blue star. Green triangle. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Green triangle, blue star. Whee! Got it. Green triangle. Blue is the star. Okay, so now we can just kind of go through this. So now I just need to find yellow and red. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, okay. So I'm just gonna find Molly as we kind of go out and go throughout and do this. The two by go. Time to find Molly. Molly, are you in here again? Oh, good. You didn't make another surprise appearance, did you? <laughs> oh, okay. Thank you. Orange circle? Or is that red? Orange circle. Whee! Oh. I'm just back here. Orange circle? Okay, so it was yellow circle. Yellow circle. Come on. Come on. Yeah, there we go. And I didn't see the red one, but process of elimination will get us through. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave now. I'm just gonna leave now. I'm gonna go through. I can just feel the texture. <laughs> of this play place. Weird polyurethane plastic with soft padded everything. Oh, down the side we go, I guess. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Okay, so we're on the other side. What is this? Let's press the button, find out. I don't know what it's supposed to do. Well, let's keep moving. I gotta find me a Molly. I gotta find. What was her last name? I don't remember. Oh, something's gonna come out of me. Surely. Molly? Hi, Molly! Hi, Molly! <laughs> this is 
bit my throat out. Okay, I had to see what would happen if I got caught. I always want to see what these games do with their like animations and other things. Very interesting. Oh my gosh, you were caught by Molly McCaw. It's pretty creepy. Molly can repeat words that she's heard. Don't be fooled. Oh, that's pretty creepy, actually. Okay, let's do it again. Let's do it again. Press E to respond. <laughs> Just imagine Pop, no, not no, Poppy Playtime. Can't throw them into the same thing. Uh, uh, Ban Ban, <laughs> when you die. Press E to be reincarnated. And then just a random letter. I was out there, but did just open that door. I guess I'll go press it again. I guess I'll press this button again. Aha, the button. Okay, time for Molly. Molly time. Hi, Molly. Bye, Molly! <laughs> I'm out of here! Oh, look at that. Oh, whoa, whoa! Oh, my... <laughs> That's not fair! She was behind me! <laughs> That's not how physics work! <laughs> she teleported! That's not real! Okay, well, I guess I didn't need to get caught the first time because I was gonna get caught the second time already. Let's get it back. Let's get this thing rolling again. Beep boop. Beep boop. Beep boop. Beep boop. All right, Molly, come at me. Come at me. Let's go. This way. This way. What are you saying? I can't. I can't understand you. Woo! Ball pit. Whee, whee. Molly's gonna be in there. Yep, there she is. <laughs> Saw those glowing eyes. Oh my gosh, she's pretty quick. She's pretty quick. She's very quick. She's very quick. <laughs> I jumped. I jumped. I jumped again. Okay, okay. Okay, yep, that that's Molly. That's Molly! She's so quick! <laughs> Go faster! Music's pretty sick, though. Oh my gosh, the foam pad. This way? Collectible! I got it! <laughs> okay. Oh my, <laughs> she's right there. <laughs> Come on. Come on. We got this. We got this. I don't think Molly knows how to turn fast. Hi. Sorry, I gotta get in here. tracking that you're scared, you're angry, upset. Transparency is an important part of our policy here at Indigo Park, so <laughs> we need to be honest about something. What? What do you got? It's been inactive for years. Yeah, I know. Stop showing up. Guests too. Yeah, I figured. Mascot, sir. Mascot whore? I just was so excited to see a visitor, and I wanted to be sure you were given the best experience possible. Grody. But I was confined to the entrance for so long, I didn't realize just how much disrepair the park is... Into. Poor rambling. Time. Eh, sorry for the inconvenience. Oh my gosh, look at my nails. But, but I have an idea. Oh, I have what's your idea? To the repair documentation in my database. I just can't execute most tasks without authorization from a human user. You must have come here because the park matters to you too, right? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Be willing to help me restore the park. <sighs> I, I can tell where this is going already. You aren't opposed to this. I'm so excited. Let's get this place back in business. Yeah, there's your eye glitch again. I can already see where this is going. Hi. Uh, Rambly is actually the most evil of them all and has been confined to the front of the park. And uh, these are my speculations. Uh, <laughs> and us repairing the park is actually giving Rambly the ultimate power 
to wreak havoc and okay. destroy the world. Welcome to the crew, Rookie Wrangler. Registered. Your first official job as one of Rambley's Wranglers Registered is to get out of the Rambley's Wranglers Registered room. <laughs> Head left Registered. towards the Rookie Wrangler Registered security room to set yourself free. Phew. Kind of Thanks. exhausting to say that whole spiel. But Rambley's Wranglers Registered is a registered trademark. <laughs> that expired yesterday. Oh, let's go! It's free use, baby! Okay, see ya. Oh, these are weird stairs. Okay, fine. Wranglers only. That's me. <gasps> A little rambly. Hmm. Is that collectible? Can I have that? No, I already had one of you. Um, there's so many little things here that look like collectibles. Are you a collectible? Uh -oh. That Rambly's Wrangler's room is only accessible by Royal Wranglers. Royal Wranglers. One day you'll grow up big and strong enough to enter it. But for now, don't. Okay, fine, fine, fine. So rude, so rude to me. We leave. <laughs> okay. Hello, Rambly. Uh, sweet. Well, oh, look at this. Look at this. Surveillance cameras. I'm on observation duty. Any weirdos? Any weirdos that I should be aware of? No. Seems pretty fine. It's uncomfortably quiet in some of these areas, which is a good thing. <laughs> There's a lot of outlets. <laughs> Why are there so many extension cords? <laughs> Who needs all of those? Okay, well, let's keep moving. I wonder if Molly's gonna come back from the dead headless and just be start chasing us. I can definitely see that. I can definitely see that. Oh, look at this. We're back out here? Where is this? Oh, this is the... That's not the clock tower. Oh my gosh, another information booth! Oh, I have all the collectibles! Oh my gosh, look, I'm so good at this. Poodle plush. It's a weird poodle plush. Doesn't seem to be an indigo product. Sure doesn't look like any character you've seen in the parks. Maybe a child left it behind. Hey, buddy. Did you dig that out of the lost and found? Or was it in the trash? No surprise, I guess, that our park would dispose of a non-indigo brand toy. I suppose he'd make playtime special for a child with poor taste, though. <laughs> The way your head leans forward, it's pretty wild. Um, let's check on the Rambleberry. This thing popped out of the Rambly Rush arcade cabinet. How is this even possible? Do you think it's edible? Whoa, where'd you get that? Rambleberries are my favorite. Oh, if only I could jump out of the screen and take a big bite. Foreshadowing? Maybe I'll be able to one day. Foreshadowing? Uh, what else did I pick up? Oh, the Rambly head? Whoa, freaky. This must be one of those mascot costumes they used to use at the parks. In a weird way, kind of glad they retired these. Whoa, where'd you find that? I've never seen anyone wearing one. Pretty snazzy. Pretty snazzy, huh? Ooh, looks like there's an audio recording tagged with costume in my database I've never noticed before. Let's listen, let's listen. Let's go, let's go. Hey, Jackson, you hear about the new mascots? Yeah. Think it'll put us out of a job? I think so. Old sport. And right after we got this damn raccoon costume. Man, screw this place. I say we get our asses out of here and go straight to Vegas. Oh, come Vegas. on. They didn't even document the Indigo inventory ID for the costume. I was really looking forward to that. What a useless recording. Deleted. Deleted? Why'd you delete it? Um... Wait, why was I able to walk through it there? <laughs> this is weird. Strange use of this. Uh, and then what was the other one? It was just this little thing, right? The Retroid, L Retro Laloid plush. I always find it weird when companies make merch that's supposed to look old. Laloid obviously had an older la look in this classic Indigo cartoons, but I'm not sure it la looked la like this. I guess nostalgia sells. they only make one of Lloyd? It's because he's the loudest? I can be loud too! Where's my limited edition throwback plush? Where's Molly's? Where's Finley's? Give this mistake to a child and they'll cry. Oh, wow, well, jeez, jeez, this guy hates Lloyd! Why do you hate Lloyd so much? Okay, well, that's everything. Um, cool. It's funny, even Disneyland did that. Um, with the the throwback plush with the, I don't remember what his name is. I, I, I never was a big Disney guy. 
I just like to go into Disneyland every once in a while. Um, it was in California Adventure. I'm talking about the California one. Uh, California Disneyland, not Florida Disney World. Um, Oceanic Odyssey, the quick pass, standby. Oh, you made it to Oceanic Odyssey. You yeah, I did. A great job, Rookie Wrangler. Thank you. Uh, here I go. Here I go. Oh my gosh, so cool. You'll find a pumper and porpoises, pickles, and perches as far as the eye can see. Please don't tap the glass. I'm gonna tap that glass. Oh, is this the end of the part one? I'm assuming. It is. It 100% is. Hey, yep. buddy. You okay? Called it. You look kind of tired. Do you need a moment? Don't worry, it's fine. I don't blame you for taking a rest after all that. Heck, I could go for a nice, relaxing defragmentation myself. But before you settle down. You up for a little survey to help us improve the park? Thanks for visiting Indigo Park. Hope all your dreams came true. A whole if singing you're section. Time, you're up for a lark. Stick around for the rambly review. I'm here to offer my best to each valuable guest I assist. And lots of happy feedback ensures I get to exist. Let's try it. Were you satisfied with the rides? Yes or no. Were you satisfied with your guide? I sure hope so. Do you plan to come back? Will I see you again? Did your experience convince you to tell a friend about us? Did I earn your trust? At Indigo Park. You just turn this into a musical! Get this out of here! <laughs> this place should be. But out of the dark, you've given a spark of sunshine to this kingdom's faithful devotee. At Indigo Park, more than my remarks are mysteries. Even I don't know what we might find. But fight through the dark, and I'll be your spark of sunshine to get you out of any bind. I feel like they put. If you want to keep going. A lot of work yeah, just no into this. Fair to you. It's an awful lot to ask. <laughs> just kind of cool. But here comes Rambly Review Part Two to sell you on our task. Part Two, I'm no. Review and assess each valuable guest as I learn, and lots of happy feedback ensures you're gonna return. I'm so happy you rode a ride. And saw the show. I'm so happy to be your guide. What about Lloyd? Come back anytime. I'd love to see you again. In all my thousands of days, I've never had a friend like you. At least I hope I do. At Indigo Park, there is a stark contrast to everything I know this place should be. But out of the dark, you've given hmm. a spark of sunshine to this kingdom's faithful devotee at indigo park more than my remarks are missing. what's going on in the background i don't know what we might find but fight through the dark and i'll be your spark of sunshine to get you out of any find they, they would why do they have to go so hard on the music? Okay, I'll let you go. See you next time, buddy. See you later. See ya la later. <laughs> I wish I kept that, kept that joke going the entire uh, playthrough. That would have been great. Thank you. Indigo Park is a full on passion project that we've been working on for a little over a year now. Stories and world that we want to create with Rambly and his friends are very special to us, but with the scale of this game, we're going to need some help. If you enjoyed your experience with Chapter 1, consider supporting our socials if you want to see Chapter 2. No matter what happens, we hope you enjoyed your stay. Thanks for visiting Indigo Park. Check out our channel. Oh, cool. Rambly the Raccoon. Cool. Yeah, that was cool. I, I think uh, I think they have a good uh, grasp on kind of the styling of, uh, obviously, a good... I don't... I don't know if you want to call it a mascot horror or not, but um, I mean, that's definitely what it is. <laughs> that's what all these games end up kind of are being categorized under, even if it is just a general horror game when they have these kind of like childlike aesthetic to everything and having these cute, cuddly mascots as the kind of horror elements. 
Um, you, you can't you can't really describe it any other way. But I think the game has a lot of cool potential for it. Glad that the first part is free. I, I like the fact that it's a again like they explained it's a passion project for themselves. So I hope that love and creativity is continued throughout the game, and that. I don't expect them to, but I, I hope these devs don't kind of go out and be like, Oh, you know what? This game's a hit. Let's just push them out. <laughs> like some other games that shall not be named. Um, that are, that's fine too, but it's nice to see when uh, a game has a lot of care put into it. They seem to be kind of falling behind in the more of the poppy playtime uh, formula where Again, release a first chapter, and then the next chapter might be paid, may not be. Uh, hopefully it's it's a bit more in depth if there's a second part. Um, again, I don't know if, if, I don't know what their intentions are. So I, I have no way to really kind of explain anything further, just kind of like a hope and feeling. Like this may just be a second part of the game and that's it. Or it could just be a full fledged, kind of series of games, um, like Poppy Playtime, Chapter 1, 2, 3, etc. And I think either way they go with it, it could be pretty cool. You have a lot of opportunities with a theme park, obviously with different worlds, different lands to go explore within the theme park. You have so much other, like, source material to kind of work off of, whether it's Disneyland, or any of the other major theme parks or smaller theme parks out there kind of finding inspiration from little bits and pieces here and there and kind of finding the rundown, broken places. Even like we're watching like Urbex channels that go and visit like abandoned theme parks is really cool and really fun. Um, so I'm interested to see what they do with this. Curious to see like what their overall inspiration is continued for it, but really cool to see some cool indie horrors that are coming out and again just being a free game it's always super nice for anybody to just jump in and be able to experience this and see if they want to continue supporting it later on if there are more chapters but yeah glad you all introduced me to indigo park asked me to play it of course if you enjoyed this video make sure you hit that like button leave a comment down below love to hear any thoughts and feelings from you all if you're not already subscribed consider doing so hit that bell notification that we know exactly when i'm uploading any new videos if you'd like to see any more content from me welcome to follow me on any of my other socials always listed in the description down below but of course that all being said you all are awesome you all are amazing and i can't wait to see you all in the next video. Later!